Yeah, my name is Ralph Herbrick and I'm director of machine learning at Amazon. One thing I really like is our culture of um, day one and being misunderstood for a long time. So when we take, a, take an idea, um, you know, we, we take a long-term view on it. We always start what, what pain point is it solving? We don't start with the technical difficulty. We don't start with necessarily what's the, what's the challenge from a business perspective. We start with which pain point is it solving? Yeah, so one area where AI is applied that excites me the most is actually in the ripeness prediction of fresh fruit. So today, 50% of all fresh fruit, of vegetables and fruits, goes to waste from the field to the kitchen. And if we can make that number smaller, I think that's a great thing for, from a business perspective, for the customer, and for society. It's, for the future of AI, it's incredibly important that it gets democratized. So 10 years ago, AI was a discipline that was um, only available to a handful of scientists. And I think for the future of AI to be uh, bright and, and impactful, it needs to be made easy to use um, and easy to, uh, easy to access um, in its difficulty. Yeah. So it's a very interesting research culture we have. We don't start with a technical challenge. We don't start with a scientific difficult uh, problem. What we start with is a press release that addresses a customer use case of AI. And only when we believe we're actually solving a customer problem, what we call working backwards, we, we start to match that with the capabilities that algorithms have to, to address that, to scale that, or to allow that. So an example is Alexa, speech recognition. Or the use case is to make it easy to play music, listen to, the, hear about the weather, or, or, or make, make orders. Um, and the technology is speech recognition and text-to-speech generation and natural language understanding. I think it's a more, um, the future of AI, I think it's, it's very beneficial. And I think one thing that we do to participate in, in assessing and, and advising um, to best uses of AI in, in society is our participation in the partnership. So we're one of the founding members of the partnership of AI, precisely to help um, devising best practices and, and you know, tailor and, and direct scholarly research into how it's beneficial. A second thought is also that AI is a tool um, like many other mechanistic, me mechanical tools we have that helps us to automate certain tasks to lock up time for creative tasks. So one thing I've been looking forward to at the World Summit was meeting up with uh, a lot of friends from science and industry. So for example, to be with Max Welling on the panel this morning and catch up with Gary Marcus. And, and I think it's incredible what bench of scientific and technical and industry leaders in this field you've assembled here.